Okay, basically I'm just saying that you're, uh, the conclusion that, uh, that this is pseudoscience just because a heart specialist said it, who it wasn't a specialty, when before, a few minutes before, you had said that a neuroscientist had, uh, sorry, a neurologist had uh, played a part in this by saying there was not enough processing speed in the brain, um, was a slight contradiction in your argument, and believers in this sort of thing could misinterpret your argument based on that. So just a warning um, as to how to further strengthen your argument. Another way to uh, properly strengthen your argument is when you just simply say that it's a load of crap that, um, that people can't see without their eyes. It might do well uh, to debunk the so-called the so supposed psychic aspects of near-death experience and while you're at it, connect it to the existing parapsychological research and point out the flaws that have already been uh, present in existing ESP studies. Go into fairly good detail or reference people to better uh, sources for this because the problem is, is that um, just by simply saying this sort of stuff like it's just a load of crap right off the bat, people could assume that you're just making a categorical statement and not backing up your argument. As a fellow skeptic, just trying to help you uh, strengthen your arguments a little bit here, I hope this helps. Otherwise, keep up the good work. Toodles!